whatever happened to Rover? And I say, nothing, he's fine. He's one of the few 42-year-old Labradors. <laughs> they go, oh, yeah. What do you think happened? <laughs> he's dead. Did you mention that on IMT? Did he die on IMT or afterwards? Um, I mean, during the period lot, of IMT, a lot, lots, lot lots of, of others people, did. A lot of people did. <laughs> I'll do the jacks, mate. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, Bert and Patty, Newton, took him. And I think he, he died with them. You think? You don't know? Yeah, you. he did die with them. It was a... It was a very sad occasion. I remember Bert ringing me, saying, you'll never guess. And I said, Patty's dead. And he said, no, Rover. <laughs> I was born in Balaclava. Went to school at Caulfield Central. There's my Aunt Helen. That's me in the front. And there's my mum to the right. There's me holding a little... I'm marching and concentrating with the tongue stuck at... Which I still do in the corner of the mouth. Then I went to Melbourne High School. And then, when I left school, I applied for a job at 3UZ, didn't get it. Then they, 3UZ rang me and said the job I'd applied for wasn't available, but there was another one in the record library, which meant as the records came out of the studio, I would file them. If it wasn't for uh, the late Clifford Nichols Witter, I certainly wouldn't be here today. That was my big break yeah. uh, in the business. Could you deny that you enjoy the mantle of being the king of television still, even No, no, no. I, I didn't call myself king. I did, your journalists called me king and golden boy and mercurial and all those... There are worse titles, aren't there? Yes, but a lot of people think, oh, you know, he thinks he's the king of television. I don't think that at all. Someone else thought that. But you were the king. Ray, we were too busy to think about kings or... There was no jealousy, as I remember. If you're doing no a queens. five... I beg your pardon? No queens? A few. 